what's up guys so basically uh playing some ultima 7 and last we left off we found this new little place uh, this little town and we're just investigating what it's all about light source so some sort of seance or something home. That doesn't stop us from taking their their food, their valuable items. I don't need a hood. I could always use a light source. Steal. Although, So, those of you who are not, uh, have not been following along, I use the Ultima Exalt engine, which basically just modernizes the game engine here a little bit. Sort of what the heck's going on here. No, sorry, okay. Yeah, it modernizes the uh, game engine a little bit here. So, I have basically the screen here, hopefully. Probably just running a little slowly because I'm doing also some recording as well. happening yet. Oh, just as I say that, this little doggy, whatever that is, that better be food. And there's no food whatsoever. That was useless. We just killed a dog or a wolf. A silly little wolf who tried to attack us. going on in here. Man, this place is a mess. Dearest Iolo, the buccaneer's den, I came across an old pirate who told me he had sailed across waters of Britannia more times than I was summer old. 
On a gamble, I asked if uh, he had ever heard of the legendary Serpent Isles. He had, and he even had a map that would tell how to locate the island. I bought the map and have already begun my search. However, I made a copy so that they may as follow me after the current adventures have ended. I have left a copy with Lord British, but he promised he wouldn't not give it until the has completed the explorations with Adele. Adele is me. Till I see thee again, my love, Gweno. Alright, so I guess that's how Serpent Isles starts. I see magical item! Magic bolt. Let's take it. Let's take it. Too heavy. Tell me details of many adventures after. Okay, I don't need to know my own adventures. So that was Iola's. Let's talk to Iola, see what he has to say. Name, job, fellowship, okay. I do not know much about them except they originated from... Okay, that's not what I want. I want to ask him about his... Uh, his thing, his little, his little woman, whoever... Or I'm assuming is a woman. That called him my love. Okay, there's absolutely nothing here. I want to ride this horse. I could kill this horse though. Name. What is your name, horse? Yes, I have a name. Scoundrel, when thou art asked thy name, thou should respond politely and accurately. The avatar has to ask thee for that name. My name, you can tell call me what I want, but I won't respond to Smith. So it's a talking horse. Yep. That's what I told you to call me. Oh, I get it. You want something from me, don't you? Yes. I thought as much. You've always been a selfish one. What do you want now? Let's see. Money? Advice? Happiness? No, you usually want some sort, don't you? Of course. You've become altruistic over the past 200 years. You want to... I know you want to save Britannia. Wow, oh, you're a cheeky one. To save Britannia. You really to expect me to believe that? You're just in this for the money. Uh, no, there's no money in this, buddy. <laughs> I think I'm gonna kill this horse. Happiness. Who doesn't? Keep on going back to this dialogue tree here. We're gonna kill this horse after we're done talking. A clue. Now we're getting to the nitty gritty. Okay, I'll give you a clue. But what is it for me? Let me guess. Money, love, not knowing you probably know nothing. With any luck, you'll go away and leave me alone. Uh... Sorry, I don't get into that. What the? Break. Let's kill this horse. Uh, 
Okay, I look. Your disrespectful horse needs to die. Come on. It's not even a horse, it's gonna be. It's gonna be you. Oh, the guards are coming. It's like Skyrim, man. You kill a chicken and all of a sudden. Oh, man. This donkey kicked my ass. This ass kicked my ass. Alright, so that is why we save it, boys and girls. <laughs> so we don't experience that. Where did that guard come from, man? Like, just out of nowhere. It's like a s teleporting guard just appeared. Like, from the ground. It's ridiculous. Okay, I am stuck. The woman you see in front of you has a concerned expression on her face as if her thoughts were away. What is your name? My name is Penny, my lord. What is your job? I have no occupation, my lord. At least not one I would call work. I do, however, teach skills in close combat. Think for a moment. I suppose a better way to answer that question would have been, yes, I have a job. I am a trainer. But, she smiles, I enjoy too much to call it work. my lord. At least not one I'd call work, however, I do teach now. Uh, yeah, we already talked about that. I've loved close quarter fighting since I was old enough to grasp my first spear. That is why I moved to you. Okay, so we're in you. I moved here to hunt, of course. Of course, it's full of game, but I would not think of living anywhere. My choice in arms, the spear combines the best of both range and power. It is a perfect hunting weapon. No, I don't. Let's see how tough she is, huh? Let's see how good you are with that spear, and I bet some guard will appear out of nowhere. Come on, let's go. And as I predicted, these guards just came out of the bush. She wasn't so tough after all, though. There's two of these guards. Three now. And they just killed us. Four. Okay, and this is why we restore boys and girls. Boom. Let's just forget that happened. Okay, I don't see any guards around the corner. So those guards are just popping out of nowhere. You're worse than the guards from Oblivion. I'm going to go into your house and steal your crap. You look like you don't have any crap at all. Ooh, maybe you do. that? What's this? Crusted helm. I don't want a crusted helm. So let's now we now that we know where we are. In you, Iola's home. Or at least I think it's his home. At least that's where his main squeeze lives. Two arms. Who 
Who's this guy? Who's this guy? I see a man learning on leaning on a longbow. Name. I am Bradman. Job. Why well, it's my job to train the men who visit you to become more agile. Does everyone train here? The forest attracts a lot of people who want to spend more time away from the larger towns like Minnock and Britain, so they come to you. They come to you, ha ha ha. And something about the woods makes most people want to explore. He pats his bow. That is where uh, this comes in. The bow is a tool of survival of the forest, and I, he jerks the thumb uh, to his chest, chief proficiency with a bow. Explore. There are many exciting things to see in the forest. Not a day goes by when I do not see something interesting, a new type of bird, a beautiful butterfly, a best of all, a deer. Deer, I like deer. Yummy. I love the forest, it is very beneficial. Also, he raises the bow. I moved out here to be near the great archers Iola and uh, Tessermed. Iola blushes. I am honored, my friend. I was not aware I had an admirer in this part of the land. He bows to Bradman, who turns the gesture. So, this is definitely Iola's home. He is a great archer who resides in the forest. He moved here to get away from the far too quickly uh, growing towns. Penny. Thou has met Penny. I hope thou has trained with her. He winks. She is a valuable friend, but she hunts as well as a uh, weed, and she is as clumsy as an ox. I am afraid she knows nothing about fighting. Okay. This weapon, uh, this is my weapon of choice. It makes a keen eye and a steady arm to choose accurately, shoot accurately. I think it has more fitness than a sword or a spear, for example. Okay, let's uh, let's kill him. And as I predict, a guard from nowhere will appear. Let's go. Let's go, buddy. Come on, where's those guards just popping him from the bushes? Are they hiding in the trees? Oh, he just killed me. <laughs> oh, man. And he didn't even use a bow. He used a sword. Yeah. That didn't go over very well. You might notice I'm talking a little funny in this video. I got a bit of a fat lip uh, I was sparring the other day in martial arts, and I took a good one to the face, so it's a little hard to talk, actually. It's a cool little town. Oh, oh yeah. What was that, a parrot? Ooh, cheese. Cheese just lying there. Cheese, Louise. You know what? We don't have room, so someone should eat it. And you should eat it. Oh. We have enough cheese to go around. The frig is spark. Oh, they don't want cheese, eh? You want to be picky, eh? Well, hold the cheese so when we're hungry. We'll eat it. Stupid kid. He's probably... He was the one to probably kill that parrot or whatever attacked us. Nothing there. Oh, what a boring ass town. More cheese! Yum, 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 yum. Bread, too. We steal everyone's food. That's how we do it. 
getting the kid to hold the food all the time because he always complains that he's I'm hungry, I'm hungry. What do we have here? Okay, I think we're safely out of town. It's safe to say it's that we're out of town. Uh, I might just restore it to go back to where I came because I think I got a little lost. Ooh, what's this cave? Let's look. Let us look. Cave. Adventure. It's like some sort of dungeon. Locked. Okay, let's restore. Give me one second. Bear with me for a second. Okay, uh, I think we need to go back up here so there's more action and excitement. Let's get the deer! Kill a deer! Oh, whoa, 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 look at these guys. It's not just deer, it's friggin' cyclops. These guys just came out of nowhere. Now let's kill the deer. Kill the deer. Let's get him. Let's get him. Come on. Come on. Why? It's not killing the deer. We need the food. Okay, let's kill the next deer. Come on, die deer, die. Die, Bambi. I think that deer just attacked me back. He just fought back. Nice. So, even though that was a tough battle, we did get a lot of food out of that. See if we hopefully we have room to carry the food. See if the kid can carry it. Good. Good, good, good. I 
think he's carrying it. These Cyclops guys have gold. Where's a deer? Oh, I think he might be out of room. Yep, he might be out of room. We might not be able to. Well, let's see if we can eat this stuff. Maybe that'll get everyone refreshed after a nice, tough battle. Okay, so let's see. Let's, whoa. Okay, so first, let's feed you. What? You don't want to eat? You guys don't want to get fat? Okay, we need to carry that food, man. Can't let that food go. We probably have enough food for days now. That sucks. I got all this food that I can't carry. Food is, is crucial. And none of these fuckers want to eat. Pardon my French. Okay, we gotta leave all this food here. That is uh that is a waste. Gold! We want gold. Okay, well... Hopefully we have room for gold. Crap. Like, I need to sell off a lot of crap because nobody can carry all this crap. Don't even have room for gold nuggets. Ah, oh, that sucks. Alright, we need to uh, move on then, I guess. Nobody wants to eat. It's a waste of food. But you know what? Maybe we can rest in this house and then eat the food. Like what time is it? That's a good idea. Uh, how many hours? 12? Sure, why not? Work up, wake up at 5 a.m. Maybe these friggin' people will be hungry. Sleep uh, three more hours. Great, everyone is rested up. Who did, was that that just walked in? 
Is that food still there? Ah, uh, crap. Uh, let's try that again. Let's see if I can put the body, put it into the bodies or something like that. Put that there. Put that there. Put that there. This way the food doesn't go away. I guess these guys were having their meal. They were eating. Pumpkin. You're even having a pumpkin. Okay, so put all the food in that guy's body. And now let's go back to sleep. That way everyone gets healed up as well. Twelve hours. Very good, very good. Yes, my friend, rest and heal. So that you are strong and able to face the perils before you. Oh, shut up. Pleasant dreams. Shut up, you creepy dude who's following me around. Alrighty, now let's see if we have food again. It's kind of snowing or something. Or raining. Oh, more deer! More deer, let's kill it! Stop! Stupid deer, run! <laughs> Some nice protein for the morning. Okay. Now then, let's see if this guy uh, can feed him. Yes. Nice. Everyone's fed. Anyone want seconds? Stuff your faces, man. Stuff your faces. Because we're not going to eat for a while. I don't want to hear you bitching and complaining that you're hungry. Okay. Uh...
Let's see if I can store that body. I'm going to take this dead body and I'm going to try to stuff him in this house. Shoot, where did he go? Where did he go? Aw, oh, man. Lost the body. Crap. Who the heck is attacking us? It's a parrot or something. Oh, there's still some more food here. Okay, where did that body go? Damn, I lost him. Give it up then. Stupid trees in the way. Sorry, I was just trying to stuff that dead body in the uh, in the house so I could come back to him. Ah, forget it. It's too bad. Okay, let's continue to explore you. That just took a good 20 minutes. Oh, there's a, one more. This guy's been lurking around. So let's just see for the sake of experiment if I can actually move this guy's body all the way into the house just to see if I can do that yeah I could have done it could have done it you know what I'm gonna take all that food And put it here, put it here, and I'm going to see if I can store this body in this house. Nice little house gift. <laughs> nice little dead body. Okay, so store the de dead body. So I can come back for those gold nuggets at a later time when I free up my inventory. Oh, I didn't actually see what's in here. Nothing. Or what if I put that body in a chest? Will the body fit in the chest? Nice! Mafia style. Put the body in the chest. And the body has stuff in there. So this is more of an experiment to see what keeps what in the chest. Cool. Nothing. 
nice little picture of Lord Britain there, I, I think. All right, let's get back to exploring. Hopefully another Cyclops doesn't attack. Them. Oh, more deer. More deer. Yeah, this is a great spot for killing deer, although I can't re reach him. Come on. Uh, you know what? I'll let him go. We've done enough deer killing for one day. Damn, this bush is hard to move around. Oh, oh. We're about to get into another fight. Let's go. Let's take these big ogres on. There's more deer here. There's tons of deer here. This is awesome. Oh, you didn't even see that. That's like practically sneaking up on him and kicking his ass. Yeah, buddy. You didn't see that coming. What's he got here? Eight gold coins. At least I can take that. It's a good place to hunt, for sure, if you're hungry. Although, I'm trying to find the... Are we being attacked by bees? What's going on? Whoa! I just got a huge hit. I just got killed by... Oh, I think it's that Renegade Knight. Thank God for Restore. Oh, look at all that food. And no, no one's hungry. I think it's safe to say we lost that town. You, oh, what the heck is this? What Do you that? really know where you're going, Avatar? No, I don't, but shut up. Amazing spooky castle. Okay, I might just leave it at here to explore this just to see that there's something worth exploring here. No, it's not much here. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, this is uh, all very nice, but... Book of Forgotten Mantras. So this is some magical place. Right, 
I see no purpose of what is here, so let's move on. Keep moving. dangerous man okay I think I'm gonna leave it here so uh, we'll explore more of this forest later on in our next episode okay so let me just uh, Make a note here. Cool thing about Exult. Just came from you to the northwest and found this castle. Realized this forest is pretty vast. Explore it and find out stuff. Okay, uh, one more time, save it. Cool, that's all she wrote, boys and girls. I'll see you next time. <laughs> ah!